Fruhoff, the leading manufacturer of tipping trailers, have been busy breaking new ground in 2016. Over the last eight months, Fruhoff have introduced a series of new rigid bodies, ranging from 3.5 and 7.5 tonne multi-purpose utility vehicles to the 32 tonne, more cyclist-safe Econic and the latest additions to the range, lightweight steel and alloy rigid bodies. Fruhoff have grown into the 7.5 tonne utility vehicle market to manufacture a range of utility vehicles to suit a wide range of markets, from multinationals and local authorities to large utility companies. Fruhoff then extended their range with the design and production of the Utility 3.5. This 3.5 tonne vehicle is lightweight, can be mass produced with very short lead times and free on-site storage is available. Fruhoff worked with Sparshats of Kent, FM Conway, Erith Waste, S Walsh & Sons and Transport for London to introduce a more cyclist-friendly Mercedes Econic 32-tonne rigid vehicle. The Econic has a lower cab, lower overall height, improved side impact protection and rear impact protection as standard, as well as other innovative features designed to improve the safety of 32-tonne rigid trucks. The Fruhoff lightweight steel body is the latest addition to the Fruhoff range of Hardox steel rigid bodies and is a lightweight body. With fully pressed Hardox construction, it offers the benefit of an additional half ton payload. The Fruhoff lightweight aluminium body is a heavy duty aluminium rigid body designed for transporting sand and aggregate ready for use in a range of industries and applications. Fruhoff have developed this to be a light alloy rigid body that is robust and versatile and with a tear weight of 11,600 kilograms, its increased weight saving is a huge benefit to customers. Manufactured at their 64-acre site in Grantham, Lincolnshire, which is acknowledged for its existing precision engineering and fabrication facilities, Fruhoff products are built to last. Fruhoff are renowned for their quality control systems and techniques, with all fabrication processes, shot blasting and painting undertaken in-house. Offering market-leading turnaround times, Fruhoff products are robust, lightweight and versatile enough to suit a range of industries and applications, and in addition, carry high residual values. Fruhoff have worked with Sparshats of Kent, FM Conway and Transport for London to introduce a more cyclist-friendly 32-tonne rigid vehicle, particularly in and around the London area, with other cities likely to follow the capital's lead. This Mercedes Econic rigid truck has a lower cab, lower overall height, improved side impact protection and rear impact protection as standard. It offers superior visibility and viewing from a driver's perspective on their surroundings and cameras are fully fitted to the front, rear and side of the vehicle, recording on a 30-minute rotating basis, all designed to improve the safety of 32-tonne rigid trucks. Rear steering is an added feature for ease of manoeuvrability in narrow streets and busy town centres. These trucks are available in fully hardox bodies with grab attachments, standard steel bodies and aluminium bodies. Additional lighting is an option and a number of additional health and safety features can be supplied and fitted. All parts of the Econic 32 tonne rigid are manufactured from start to finish using the highest quality materials at Fruhoff site in Grantham. The Fruhoff Load Light is the latest addition to the Fruhoff range of Hardox steel rigid bodies. This lightweight rigid body with fully pressed Hardox construction offers the benefit of an additional half ton payload. Fruhoff have successfully developed this even lighter rigid body that is nevertheless robust and versatile, ready for use in a range of industries and applications. All parts of the load light are manufactured on site from start to finish using the highest quality materials and production can be stepped up at any time to meet demand. 
Fruhoff's legendary quality, design and construction excellence ensures that these vehicles can be turned round in as little as three weeks. The Fruhoff load light rigid body is fully type approved. Introducing the Fruhoff lightweight aluminium body, the newest addition to the Fruhoff range of alloy rigid bodies. The heavy duty rigid body is designed for transporting sand and aggregate, ready for use in a range of industries and applications. Fruhoff have developed a light alloy rigid body that is robust and versatile and with a tear weight of 11,600 kilograms, its increased weight saving is a huge benefit to customers. All parts of the lightweight aluminium body are manufactured on site from start to finish using the highest quality materials and production can be stepped up at any time to meet demand. And Fruhoff's legendary quality, design and construction excellence ensures that these vehicles can be turned around in as little as three weeks. The Fruhoff aluminium lightweight rigid body is fully type approved. Fruhoff have grown into the 7.5 tonne utility vehicle market to manufacture a range of utility vehicles to meet the demands of customers in a wide range of markets, from multinationals and local authorities to large utility companies. As part of their organic growth plan, production of the Utility 1 and Utility 2 models fits in perfectly with Fruhoff's manufacturing processes and Fruhoff's legendary quality, design and construction excellence ensures that these vehicles can be turned round in just seven days. Come in on a Friday afternoon and the vehicle will be ready the following Friday. All parts are manufactured on site from start to finish using the highest quality materials and production can be stepped up at any time to meet demand to a level of as many as 50 per week. The vehicles have as their base a steel rigid body with drop side doors on both sides and the rear and an extended headboard with a beacon on the cab. Each utility vehicle is built to a base specification with additional options available such as fall arresters, tar hatches, hand wash units, small cranes, tool chests, additional lighting and additional brackets for other equipment. Fruhoff's utility vehicles offer a weight saving of up to 200 kilograms and because all parts are laser cut and jig built for accuracy and precision, any replacement parts are guaranteed to fit first time every time, including the doors, should you need to replace them. Fruhoff Utility 1 and Utility 2 have passed rigorous inspections from TUV Rhineland and Vosa and now carry European whole vehicle type approval. Fruhoff have extended their range of utility vehicles with the design and production of the Utility 3.5. This 3.5 tonne vehicle is lightweight, can be mass produced with very short lead times and free on-site storage is available. It can be offered as a fully aluminium body, a mixture of aluminium and steel or fully steel configurations depending on precise requirements. They can be provided as tipping or non-tipping bodies with aluminium, steel or wiser deck flooring with a whole range of optional extras from tool chests, additional working lights to welfare facilities, toolbars, tow hitches and lifts. Fruhoff are also offering manufacturers and dealers free on-site storage in compounds allowing individual access if required, meaning they don't have to struggle to find storage space in major cities. Fruhoff's Utility 3.5 offers a significant weight saving and is designed to be effective wherever it is used by manufacturers and dealers. All parts are manufactured on site from start to finish using the highest quality materials and production can be stepped up at any time to meet demand. And Fruhoff's legendary quality, design and construction excellence ensures that these vehicles can be turned round in as little as a week. 
As part of their organic growth plan, production of the Utility 3.5 fits in perfectly with Fruhoff's manufacturing processes and this rigid body has been designed, tested, refined and manufactured with that in mind. A new year sees a new addition to the Fruhoff range of eight wheeler steel rigid bodies, with the latest models offering the option of a grab attachment. These new models combine a rolling chassis and grab with Fruhoff's wear resistant and large capacity body. These rigid bodies are designed to fit across a range of chassis types and manufacturers and are now suitable for an even wider range of applications and industries including construction and transport. All Fruhoff steel rigid bodies are manufactured with the highest grade and highest yielding steel available in the marketplace to give maximum wear resistance and durability. Like all Fruhoff rigid trucks, all parts of the eight wheeler steel rigid bodies are manufactured on site from start to finish, including shot blasting, painting and sheet fitting. All components are manufactured to precision on site at Grantham with state-of-the-art laser cutters and the largest press brake in the UK. The body is fully jig built for accuracy and precision and Fruhoff's build capacity enables production to be increased at any time to meet the demands of customers. After the body is joined to the chassis, the final components are added, mud guards, the cover sheet and the hydraulics, before going through the 100 point quality inspection prior to being released to the customer. Fruhoff have worked closely with major truck manufacturers, TUV Rhineland and Vosa and are now fully European type approved for N3 and N3G chassis in the UK. The supplier was there, a lot of other leading bodybuilders had sort of 9 12 months lead time, which when you're looking for trucks urgently is, is no good. Just sheer capacity of what they can build and store on site. Um, goes in one end, has sheet metal, comes out the other end as a complete sprayed body ready to go to work. It's, it's impressive within that short, short space of time. When we went and looked at it, it was a complete package. That They all come up, they, they all come with a way loader, all come with an air tail board, where a lot of the other bodybuilders, these are all extras. And this seemed to come, sort of, everything was sort of standard practice, easy sheet, way loader, air tail board, everything was all built into the one package rather than having to have loads of stuff added on. This is exactly what we sort of order or specify for the work we do. They found the chassis, Mercedes Benz found the chassis, and it was bodied, craned, and back to us, sprayed, ready to go to work within three weeks. You don't realise how what a big player they are in, in that sort of industry. And then once you've actually seen the factory and seen the production line, you realise how, how obviously how good they are at their job and how many units come off when Dave was giving us the facts and figures, how many units roll off the production line per month. It's impressive. Well, three things we do like about Fruhoff is, is the lightweight bodies. Uh, they're very robust and um, they stand up for the job. Um, and at the moment in time, I'm, I'm, I'm well impressed. I'm well impressed. At the current stage we have 17 on the fleet, we've got uh, another 5 being delivered within the next few weeks and then we're going to order some more after that. At the time we were looking for new lorries we couldn't find uh, anybody who could do the bodies in the lead time that we was after. Uh, and then Reynolds uh, spoke to Fruhoff, we um, got involved with um, Fruhoff, went up there, had a look around and the lead time they offered us was what we was after, so to speak. Saw all the welding, we saw all the uh, laser cutting machines and um, how they press them together and things like that. And yeah, it was, uh, it was an amazing place. A, a huge sight, which made me a bit more confident because the lead times. Um, so yeah, it was good, impressive. It's very tough for these lorries, very, uh, especially come the winter months. Uh, these bodies need to stand up to uh, a lot of hard work, a lot of hard work. These seem to be doing it, and you know, which makes me impressed with 
you know, like I keep saying, everything they've done, times, weights, it, it looks good. It's, we're happy. You know? We had uh, lorry, chassis, waiting, no bodies. So when we got in, involved with Fruhoff, excellent. Um, lead times, like I say, was a matter of weeks, not months. And that's really seriously important to us. And they pulled it and they came through. We're well happy. Fruhoff are always in complete control of their in-house manufacturing process, from start to finish. A precise manufacturing process means each Fruhoff tipper trailer is built to precise measurements, customer specifications and delivered on time. As 80% of Fruhoff's production processes are automated, production can be stepped up at any time without sacrificing accuracy, consistency or lead time. The weight saving on a Fruhoff tipper trailer can be as much as 250 kilograms. All structural extrusions are unique to Fruhoff and the trailers carry European type approval. Both the chassis and body are precision engineered and uniquely, Fruhoff produced both of these components, completing the process from raw materials at the start to the finished tipper trailer at the end in three weeks. At all times, Fruhoff hold four weeks worth of consignment stock, ensuring parts are always ready to go into production. One month stock of aluminium extrusions, axles, wheel rims and tyres are all stored here. Fruhoff derive great benefit from being partners with many of their suppliers and this strong relationship means any product can be built in a time frame of just three weeks. The first stage of building the chassis is to use a precise laser cutter to cut the components which form the beams. This laser cutter is an automated computer controlled machine which cuts to within 0.1 mm tolerances. Separate laser cutters and pressing machines are used for cutting aluminium and steel. The high definition plasma aluminium cutter has the capacity to cut lengths of up to 12 meters with a thickness of 35 millimeters before the components are pressed into shape. The CNC press brake machines press the metal into shape and are capable of pressing metal of length up to 12 meters and CNC machining centers manufacture all machine components for chassis and bodies. Once the component manufacture is complete, they are stored, ready to be issued in kits onto the chassis build line. The chassis jigs are built to exact specifications. Here, the beam components are tacked together, checked with a laser level to ensure the fit is correct, automatically welded, after which a hand welding finishing process is applied. All components are built, checked and measured as they are being assembled. Next, they are moved on to the tack welding jig, where the sub-assemblies are assembled into a complete chassis before a final weld is done. These jigs are purpose-built and can be adjusted to take other sizes. After the chassis is tacked together, the final welding is completed. The chassis is now ready for the shot blast area, where it will be fully prepared for painting. The shot blasting process is vitally important to ensure the chassis is perfectly clean, virgin metal ready for paint to be applied. The big thing really with shot blasting is it's the most important thing you can actually do for the triads to prepare the substrate. If you don't, you can leave things like mill scale, uh, corrosion, rust that can be on it from the manufacturer. And if it's not removed, unfortunately, when it does come off with the paint on top of it, the whole thing comes off together. So if it's not removed, the adhesion is very, very poor. So I would say it's like building a house. If, if the foundations aren't right, then the whole system is going to be wrong. This is as good, good a system as any, and the media they're using at the current time uh, gives them a nice fine finish. The chassis is then hung up and painted. Investment in the paint process delivers a guaranteed finish that has been endorsed by paint manufacturers PPG, who Fruhoff work closely with. The exceptional quality of the paint is a core strength of Fruhoff's manufacturing process. PPG have been working with Fruhoff for a long time, um, virtually since they started. There's a full specification in place which talks about film weights, which I was checking earlier on, uh, to make sure there's enough material on there, because if there's not, 
doesn't matter how good the blasting is, it will, go, it will get corroded as the water gets through to it. And what we tend to do is put forward a complete specification for the whole vehicle, both the chassis um, and the bodywork of course, and that includes everything from the blasting we were talking about earlier right the way through to the, to the finished product. The chassis or the body moves through the line in stages, blasted at the beginning, then into primer, and primer flashes off and from there into top coat, um, and then from there straight into the oven for baking. So it's a fully cured bake system and as well as durable as you can get for this type of vehicle. So all in all, they do it in a very professional manner. Um, there's all sorts of materials that are used, anything from a solid colour um, such as on the chassis to the lovely silver you see behind us, which is a base coat and clear, the same as you would see on any car. Next is the piping and wiring stage, where all electrical components and braking systems are installed and the axles are added to the chassis. This is a relatively quick process, at the end of which quality checks are carried out and the chassis is ready for the body to be added. Fruhoff produced two types of body, the bathtub design and smooth cider design. These are both produced in-house and like the chassis, the process begins with consignment stock being assembled by Fruhoff's team of highly skilled welder fabricators who have a wealth of experience in the heavy engineering industry. The sub-assembly process is where the doors, floors, sides and ribs for the respective body types are precisely cut into shape, tacked together and then components are hand welded on before final welding is completed. For the bathtub design, the sides are made up first, then the floor built from component parts and welded together. The sides are tacked together, the ribs are added and then finally the door. The rib jig former ensures that each rib is a consistent fit and built to specification. The ribs and body are welded together and a finishing weld is done. Finally, the rear door is put on and any other finishing touches are applied. For the smooth cider, two people assemble the floor while the sides are prepared in another bay and are put together after the floor, ready for the door to be added and then prepared for painting. As parts are built to high tolerances, which ensure they are structurally sound, this sub-assembly process is fast and efficient. The body is then moved through the paint shop, where it is subject to a four-stage process, priming, standing, top coating and baking. After being baked at a temperature of up to 80 degrees centigrade, it emerges dry and ready to be joined with the chassis. After the chassis has gone through the piping and wiring stage and the body has come through the paint shop, the body is mounted on top of the chassis, after which it is sent to the sheet fit bay where the top sheet is added. At this stage, the wheels, lights and mud guards and any other bespoke features are also added. The first part of PDI we actually do is take the sales spec from the sales office down onto the shop floor. We go through every line item on the sales spec to make sure that A, the trailer is actually built to customer requirement and B, it actually still falls within regulations which are set by VOSA. Every test we do, whether it's checking the torque settings of a wheel nut to a torque setting on a hanger bracket, every test we carry out here has to comply and every trailer that leaves a site at Grantham has to be road legal and within the full specification set by VOSA. After final PDI tests, stress tests and checks, the tipper trailer is ready to be driven away. Yeah, I would recommend for off. Uh, but to say, to be honest with you, for us, not really a name you have to recommend. It's a well-known name, and you know, it's, it's you know, it stands for the quality and. Uh, yeah, it's, it's certainly uh, no problem in uh, talking to anybody into having one. It's just a well-known brand. Um, you know, it's been going many years, and uh, it's a good solid trailer, lightweight, and uh, you know, it's just a good general product. Yeah, weight's definitely an issue, but sometimes you know you, you can't have something light without losing the quality. So it's you know it seems always been a good compromise with uh, 
for off, you get a good build quality and a, you know, a, a good weight as well, so it's sort of a win-win situation. They're quite local to, mis to myself personally, so uh, that's always a, a bonus. Um, just the build quality and the fact that they've been around so long, you know, they've got the brand, and, you know, it's just, um, just an all-round package really. Yeah, yeah, always been good, yeah, always never had any trouble and, uh, you know, anything that's ever gone wrong or we've needed anything, we've always, you know, someone's ended up phone and uh, we've got it straight away. Like I say, we're being close, you know, we're not too far, jump in the van, nip down and, and uh, everything's sorted, yeah. Uh, just good build quality, really, that's, you know, the main thing, really, I think it's just, you know, just a quality, uh, quality product. You know, I've known Dave for quite a while, uh, you know, before his throw off years and uh, I've always had, you know, He's always had a lot of time for Dave, he's, uh, he's a nice bloke and uh, you know, he's always done me proud to be fair, so yeah, we're pretty up there, I think obviously Dave's up, to, up the game and run the factory uh, longer hours to, to get lead times down and uh, obviously it's paying dividends because you know, they're getting more out the door. I, I literally ordered a trailer beginning of this year, got it, I rung him up four or five weeks ago for another one and it's, it's going to be here in about three weeks. It's very quick to be fair, they always seem to uh, help you out if you can, like, you know. I ordered, uh, I've had a bulk tipper trailer off of uh, Dave, throw off, uh, and I've just ordered a couple of aggregate trailers, um, you know, basically the same thing, uh, you know, build quality, uh, local, you know, English built, and uh, obviously the weight of them, it's, you know, it's just a good compromise for us, so, you know, just a, an all round good product, and, uh, you know, obviously we'll uh, look to doing uh, a lot more in the future. Of Phil Clark Contract Haulier. Uh, this is um, my trailer. Uh, brought off, um, very pleased with it. First time I've seen it today. It's in, I've done the order and everything, and, but that's the first time I've seen it today. Yeah, and I'm very pleased with it. I chose through off because I already run two half pipe design tipping trailers, and uh, I wanted to try through off for a change. The weight they quoted me was very favourable, lighter than my previous trailers, and I thought being red, bit of sign writing, that look a nice trailer. Through off, I've found very easy to deal with. Easier than I must say in previous trailers. <laughs> uh, yeah, very professional. Carl Spooner, who works for Through Off the Salesman, has been very good in quoting me accurate weights, accurate prices, liaison with me through the design and the options. Yeah, I'm very pleased with the outcome. That is how I wanted it. Yeah, very pleased, very good company. The half pipe, because of its design, is it, the strength is within it, without having um, uh, outside structural support strength. So therefore, if you cut down some of your ribs and some of your other outside strength, you're cutting down the weight, and that's the key to it: is cutting down weight. The less weight the, phys the trailer is, the more weight you can put on it, and that's what you get paid for. I'm very pleased with the with the weight that that is. Um, I've probably got half a ton advantage over the other trailers. Now, it doesn't sound a lot, but that's five load a day, 25 load a week, 100 loads a month times half a ton. So you can st soon do two loads extra in a month for nothing. And get paid for it for doing no extra. The design as well, also you get a fuel advantage as well. That's going to be more economical to tow that uh, through the air than it is a uh, ribbed uh, conventional trailer. Aerodynamics advantage on it, yeah.